Big defensive play by the Eagles. Eagles take over. All right, let's see if Norris County can reverse the momentum. It was all Norristown in the first half. It's been all Plymouth White Marsh in the second. Norristown in the power eye. There's a handoff to Hartman. Breaks free. Staggers ahead. Picks up about 15 yards. Rondell Hartman playing his game of games. Nice run by the young man. 15 yards and a first down. Ball on the Eagles, 35-yard line. Norristown in the power eye. Hand off to the up back. That would be Robbie Coleman. Stopped after no gain. By right, second and ten. Norristown back in the power eye. There's a pass to, to Harrington. Nice pass at the across midfield into Colonial Territory. Nice pass. Tommy Harrington pulled in that ball. Then off he pulled the trigger on that one, threw it with a lot of mustard. Hit him right between the eight and the five. First and ten. Norristown at midfield. Here's a, oh, a fumble again. Hartman picked it up. Gained about five yards. That ball is cold. That ball is slick. <laughs> You're right, second down, seven yards to go. They were lucky to get three. They were lucky to keep the ball. All right, Bruce Minnick flank wide to the left. Norristown in the power eye. Donolfi back to throw. There's to Witter. Down to about the 40-yard line. Pitch pattern. Donolfi right on the money again, right between the one and right between the seven. Between the one and the seven. It'll be third and two. Again, Norristown in four down territory, I would think. Third and two. Witter split wide to the left. There's a handoff to Hartman inside. First down, Rondell Hartman. All right, Norristown on a nice little drive here. I don't want to jinx it, but they're on a nice little drive. Norristown. Mixing up their plays, a pass here, a pass there, but mainly relying on good blocking up front and the hard running of their two or their three, uh, their three. <laughs> Almost picked off by number 33, Kevin Chabode. All right, here come the Eagles, third, second and ten, I'm sorry. Then off he over the ball, Norristown again in the power eye. There's a handoff to Hartman around the left side, brought down by 
number 51. That's Andy Dolan playing a whale of a game on defense. It was Dolan who stole the ball from uh, Pierce, rambled in for the go or for the tying touchdown. Third and ten. Big play for the young for the young quarterback. Here they come on a blitz. There's a screen to Coleman. Coleman's got some running room. A well-conceived screen pass. The Norristown offensive line let the Colonials, let the Colonials seep through. Danafi spun, hit Coleman in the flat, and Coleman got a first down. All right, an official timeout. It's that close. They're going to call for a measurement. Here come, here come the people with the chains. This is going to be very close. Very important call. Very important call. Oh! They got it. <laughs> Very, I mean, by by maybe an inch. <laughs> but a first down is a first down. It's first and 10, 47 seconds left to play. Ball on the 26-yard line. All right, that's Hartman. Tackled very hard. He's down. He's not getting up. All right. Official officials call a timeout. Hartman was the ball carrier. The hard tackle again. It's a very cold night, and those those hits are concussive. He might have fallen on the ball, not got the wind knocked out of him. Trainer Dennis Flynn's out there. He's sitting up. All right, he has to come off. There's Hartman, off on his own power. All right, here is it's second and nine. 24 seconds left to play in the third period in a very competitive game, a very, a very good game this evening. Nice play. All right, D Donolfi scrambles, maybe back to the line of scrimmage, maybe he lost the yard. Looking for Witter downfield. All right, that's the end of the third period with the score, Plymouth White Marsh 14, Norristown 13. And again, 14-13, hey, that missed extra point after the first touchdown. As we said earlier in the game, the Norristown kicking game, especially extra point and field goal wise, has been an adventure. <laughs> 